Hey friends, it's Miss Felicia. Today we're going to read a story out of our fairy tale book and the story we're going to read is The Gingerbread Man. Okay, so once upon a time a little old man and a little old woman lived in a cottage near the river. One morning the little old man and the little old woman were feeling hungry so the little old woman decided to bake a gingerbread man. The little old woman mixed together the flour, sugar, butter, corn syrup, ginger, baking soda, and egg to make the gingerbread dough. Then she rolled the mixture out flat and used the cutter to make it into the shape of a gingerbread man. Finally, she made some icing for his eyes, mouth, and nose, and she gave him three carrot buns. At last, the gingerbread man was ready to be baked, and the little old woman put him into the oven. Half an hour later, the little old woman opened the oven door and took out the baking sheet where the gingerbread man lay golden and crisp. Suddenly, the gingerbread man jumped off of the baking sheet and ran through the kitchen. Stop, cried the old woman, running after him. Come back, I want to eat you. But the gingerbread man didn't want to be eaten, and he was too fast for the little old woman. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. The gingerbread man ran into the garden and passed the little old man. Stop, cried the little old man, setting down his wheelbarrow. I want to eat you. But the gingerbread man ran even faster. I run away from a little old woman and I can run away from you, he said. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man, he chanted. The little old man and the little old woman chased the gingerbread man, but he was too fast. The gingerbread man ran through the yard and passed a pig. Stop, snorted the pig. I want to eat you. But the gingerbread man ran even faster. I run away from a little old woman and a little old man and I can run away from you, he said. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man, he chanted. The little pig chased the gingerbread man, followed by the little old man and the little old woman. But the gingerbread man was too fast. The gingerbread man passed a cow by the barn. Stop, mooed the cow. I want to eat you. But the gingerbread man ran even faster. I run away from a little old woman, a little old man, and a pig, and I can run away from you, he said. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I am the gingerbread man, he chanted. The cow, the pig, the little old man, and the little old woman all chased after the gingerbread man, but the gingerbread man was too fast. The gingerbread man passed a horse in the field. Stop, neighed the horse. I want to eat you. But the gingerbread man ran even faster. I run away from a little old woman, a little old man, a pig, and a cow, and I can run away from you, he said. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I am the gingerbread man, he chanted. The horse chased the gingerbread man, followed by the cow, the pig, the little old man, and the little old woman. But the gingerbread man was too fast. Then the gingerbread man reached a river and stopped. The sparkly water whirled and swirled in front of him as his reflections danced along the ripples. The gingerbread man shuddered. Oh no, I can't swim, he cried. How will I get across? A sly and hungry fox was waiting nearby. He saw the gingerbread man and licked his lips. Jump onto my tail and I will take you across the river, he said. So the gingerbread man jumped onto the fox's tail and the fox swam across the river. After swimming halfway, the fox spoke to the gingerbread man. You're too heavy for my tail. Jump onto my back, he said. So the gingerbread man ran lightly down the fox's bushy tail and jumped onto his back, holding tightly onto his fur. After a while, the fox cried, You're too heavy for my back. Jump onto my nose. And the gingerbread man sprinted down the fox's back and jumped onto his nose. But as soon as they reached the riverbank, the fox flipped the gingerbread man high up into the air, snapped his mouth shut, and gobbled him up. And that was the end of the gingerbread man. The end. All right, thanks for listening, guys. I hope you enjoyed the story. Bye.